Yo, what's up guys, it's Prestige, and today I'll be doing a seed spotlight on a few seeds that I thought were pretty cool. If you like any of the seeds in particular, let, make sure to let me know in the comments so that I can do a full seed spotlight video on one of the seeds, get very in-depth into it, since I'm gonna, just going to be doing intros to all of the seeds so that you guys can check them out at your own accord. Hope you enjoy, and let's hop in. Oh yeah, and before this video keeps going, the seed of this is 59, just 5-9, I'll type into you in chat. 5-9, and if you just want to see for sure, 59. It's, I didn't say that in the video, and that's the entire point of this, is to show you the seed. So, apologies that I didn't do it, and I'm doing it now, but seed is 59, number 5-9. Simple as that. Alright, so the first seed that we're going to be looking at is the Ice Peak Seed, Ice Hills, I'm not sure exactly what it's called, actually I can check. The Ice Plains Seed, that you saw me standing on one of the ice picks in the intro, and something I didn't cover in the intro, I am using a Steve skin because I had some skin troubles while trying to record. I kept trying, kept crashing my computer. So for this video, you'll see some vanilla Steve. I apologize if that really tears your eyes out. So as you can see, this is the Ice Plains biome. This is a pretty rare biome. I've never come across one in my vanilla plane of Minecraft. However, I haven't played too much of vanilla Minecraft while the Ice Plains have been in the game they haven't been here for too long they've been here for a good amount of time though so it's a pretty cool you spawn right in like where you saw me start the video that's where you spawn so you spawn right next to this biome the the main draw to this seed is this biome there is actually a good amount of lava in this biome but it's just a really sick biome in my opinion it's pretty hilly so it's like mini extreme hills so like medium hills let's say yeah and it's just these ice towers like most of them are tree level and some of them just skyrocket like skyscrapers there are, and there are just a bunch of cool sh uh, mountain shapes with the ice around in the ice biome so i'll leave you guys with a few uh, just kind of scroll throughs i'm just gonna speed up the video and run through all the ice so you guys can just get a nice view of it and then we'll move on to the next biome so next up we have what i think is my favorite survival island seed i've seen yet it's a survival more like a survival mountain seed you can see it spawns you right on the top of that hill mountain hill small mountain large hill and your spawn just in ocean land isn't too far away if you're gonna boat out but if you're, you want to do a survival island for a let's play or just to have an interesting time this is a pretty cool different kind of different survival island not just a mound of dirt so let's get to see this one is actually a very long seed it is five eight three nine nine three one two three zero five four two two seven nine six five oh if you can see that, I'll try and put it in my description so that you guys can just copy paste that so you don't have to type it all out. So now we're going to move to the third and final one, seed. Finally, we have our ending seed. This one spawns you in a kind of moderate area, nothing too special about it, a lot of desert. I'm actually recording this after I record everything else because the previous recording got a little messed up so you noticed I actually have a skin for this part. I'll go back to not having a skin soon. So the seed for this one is 7986734001961524201 long seed. The significant parts of the seed is that it has a stronghold at negative 1040, 128. I actually included the stronghold in this one because it's an underwater entrance and I think it's pretty cool. It's probably the coolest stronghold entrance I've seen before. There's a village and a temple at negative 400, 100, and other villages at the coordinates you see there. There's actually a second, there's actually a temple near the second village, which is pretty good. We're gonna check out the uh, this village and temple. We won't show this stuff uh, just because I only have footage of that. So, and yeah, we'll, we'll go to it now. Woo. And we're here. So you see that there's the sand temple over there and there's the village over here. Some glowstone markers, just that I remember that the village, the sand temple was there. And you can see we're at negative 4, 12, 97. So right around negative 400, 100. I actually haven't gone in the village. I just saw it and marked it up with glowstone. So I kind of want to see if there's any good loot in the uh, blacksmith shop. And I don't know if blacksmith shop stuff is a... Uh, it's always the same loot or different when you spawn. Are you the blacksmith? Why? You're not even the blacksmith. Why are you in here? 
All right, so, ooh. All right, all right. Get some bread, some iron, and uh, a iron pick, and six obsidian. I think it's a pretty good find. I don't loot them much, but it's pretty good. And then you got bookcases. I don't, I don't think I see, I didn't see a little church thing, so I, there's probably no priest where you can buy the special stuff. But there's well, and they, yeah, that's pretty cool. So that's basically the village, and now we're gonna go over to the temple. And after the temple, we'll head up the stronghold. And however, is that a, ooh, is that a ravine? Ooh, triple, that's a tri triple feature right here. Again, I haven't been here either, so we're gonna, we're gonna not blow up we're gonna not blow everything up, all right. So there is going to be, let's play this up, there is going to be the normal TNT that you can loot if you don't blow this place up. So that's a bunch of TNT you can get. I just got a high CPU usage by perhaps, whatever, bro. So some iron, gold, bones, that's, that's basic stuff. More iron, bones, flesh, iron, gold, and okay, iron horse armor. Iron horse armor is pretty good. So that, I, I'd say that's pretty, actually, one sec, there's, all right, all right, all right. I just wanted to get rid of the uh, little message. It was kind of annoying, getting in the way of the recording session. So yeah, that's the uh, temple. Kind of, we kind of glitch into the sand. And now I do want to check out this. This this isn't even a ravine. Bro. This is like a baby ravine. There's actually a lot of iron and coal in here. So that's for being a baby ravine. I think that's pretty good. So baby ravine didn't even think no it was here because I'm just a blind blind person no offense to the blind people i'm not actually blind i lied and yeah so the lot lava pit and it's special uh, so we're gonna go hit up that stronghold so all again i'll so see after you when we get there past the desert and some ocean you'll find if you're in survival with the help of your ender pearls that you legitly made or if you're in creative like me with the ender pearls that i just spawned in you'll find the ender pearls will drop right here where you see all that glowstone and where this glowstone marker is just to let you know it is at neg negative 1100 stuff so well, I, was, I was close i was close so you're gonna drop down here and you see that the you can see the structure of the stronghold right here which is pretty cool i think this is pretty cool since it's just like jutting out and like that this like this is actually this is the portal room so you can get down here you see the portal this takes you right to the portal no hassle of anything else in the stronghold you can always go explore the stronghold but this lets you in right away so you get down here you can throw your ender portals in and boom go fight the ender dragon let's get rid of the silverfish so yeah it, it takes you right to the ender portal and end portal i guess not the ender portal it's called the end isn't it I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I hope this Steve skin wasn't too horrible to look at whenever I went into F5 mode. And yeah, let me know if you enjoyed any of the seeds specifically, or if you have any questions, if the seed's not working, if I got one of the seeds wrong. I don't know how I would be able to, but just in case I did. So just let me know. Chicken, hi. And yeah, hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.